And you have to be a nice girl. Oh, here she comes. Boogity, boogity. See, that's piggy. That's Easy, piggy. Sasha. That's piggy. Pig's a good dog. Yes. Piggy's a dog. It's just a puppy. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, that's one fat puppy. <laughs> well, because she was okay with Nova as a puppy. Mm -hmm. No, 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 I, I'm allowing it. It's okay. I'm allowing it. It's okay. She I says, promise. do you realize that this thing is loose? I do. But you guys have been eating treats together. Shh. You gotta stay sick. She said that piece of apple off the floor. Oh, okay. and ate it? Mm-hmm. She's eating it. She says, huh? There's no bowl in here. What's wrong with these people? <laughs> well, there's no bowl in there. No. I didn't put her bowl in there. Excited. She'll come back in here looking for mooses. She already knows pigs or er, mooses is empty. Pig, oh. pig. Come on, pig, pig. Come on, piggy. Pig's like, get out of my way. I'm going this way. It will be nice if we can get them to be friends. See? Touch noses. Oh, see, that's a good girl. That's a good Sasha. Oh, that's a good Sasha. Yes, it is. See? Should we let her go? I don't know. It's up to mom. No, don't let her go. You could put her on a leash, but don't let her go. Well, I wasn't going to let her go and walk away. I was going to stand next to her. We don't know what she's thinking okay, yet. Sit. Sit, Moose. Sit, 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 sit. Good girl, jump. <laughs> okay. There you go. Yes, good girl. Good girl. Now sit. 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 Pig. Trying to get up. Pig, pig. pig. Because she knows where they are. Pig, pig, pig. Sit. Sit, pig. Pig, pig. Sit. Pig. Pig, pig. Sit. Hey. Look at me. Look at me. Up, she's not sit. You gotta sit. You gotta sit. <coughs> sit. Pig, pig. <coughs> pig. Look. Pig. Look. Here's some. Here it is. Come on, pig. Pig, pig. Pig. <coughs> pig, pig. She's confused because yeah. you usually here, sit there. Here, I'll sit here. there. Like swap places because you usually sit there. Yeah. Pig, come here. Pig, sit. Pig, sit. Oh, that's a good, good pig. Girl. Look that's at a her good sit. pig. Can a, oh, is that a good moo? Is that a good moo? It is a good moo. Oh. You, you got to sit. Pig sit. They're getting bananas. <laughs> We're sitting. It's just a banana, Sasha. Pig sit. Sasha doesn't even like bananas, but pig she'll sit. take one just in case it's delicious. <laughs> that's not a sitting pig. Just because everybody else that's is getting bananas. Pig. She, she says, I'll just climb up in your lap and take it. A pig's got to <laughs> sit. She's gonna be in your lap in just a minute. Pig, pig sit. Pig sit. No, no pig jump. Pig sit. Pig sit. No. Pig sit. No. Pig sit. Pig sit or pig doesn't get banana. All right, moose gets no banana. No pig banana. Pig <laughs> sit. Pig sit. Pig sit. Pig sit. Pig pig. You can smell her. You can sniff her. Pig sit. Pig sit. Sit sit. Sit pig. Pig sit. Oh, that's a good piggy. Oh, that's a very good pig. Yes, it is. Can we let Sasha sit over there by Can I sit right there? Oh, that's a good pig. Pig sit. No, pig Yeah, no you jump. can get her a little pig closer. Sit. Just make sure you hold on to her. Pig sit. Easy. Pig sit. Pig sit. Pig sit. No, that's pig jump. 
That's you what don't pick junk. Sit. You pick Sid. Hey, hey. Gentle, Sasha. No, she does not like <laughs> But she's forcing herself to eat it just because the <laughs> sit. Sit. she figures if Sasha Pig sit. is excited about it, then it must be wonderful. She took the whole thing. Oh, here she comes. Oh, 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 oh she ran over Moose. <laughs> she's like, get out of my way. I've been pigged. <laughs> it was a run by pigging. <laughs> she literally ran him over. Did you get the pig sitting on the... Yeah, camera? she's doing really well. <laughs> She's a good girl. Yeah, sure, sure. See, you guys could be friends. You could be friends just like Piggy and Moose. Dude, so I'm just gonna cook my own meal if you don't mind. I just grab this pan. Oh, Piggy and Moose are good friends. And then he doesn't have to be locked up when she's out. Moose, get that nose down. Oh, he like over the hamburger. <laughs> yeah. He's like, I don't care much for the apple, but the hamburger. Sasha's like, Try calling her, see if she'll come pig, in. Pig, 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 She hears you. She's pig, 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 I know these are moose size bites. Pick set. Pick pick. Pick 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 Gently. You guys are friends now. You guys are friends now. She says, oh, yes. That's exactly what she's thinking. I'm sitting and I'm not getting a treat for it. What is wrong here? She's got like dandruff lining her back. She just, she gets kind of dry skin. She needs a. Uh, moisturizer. Rub her down with lotion. Piggy has oh. winter skin. Stop it. Dry Stop winter it. skin. No surface. Mm. Mm. See? There's on me. This is like, I don't know what the big deal is. I've been sitting for ages. I sit all the time. Oh my god. Yeah. The floating butt. Run him over again. Yeah, she walk right over him again. <laughs> yeah. She's over it. She's going home. She's she done with all dinner. of you. Yeah. I'll go make her her dinner. Yeah. You gotta do it loud so she can sit. Yeah. I realize how she goes, and she's doing really well. Pork chop or piece of bacon. Mm -hmm. What's the matter, Sasha? Is it rainy outside? You can't go play in the garden? Mm -hmm. Oh, you cut that quick. There you go. Oh, poor baby. She just wants to go play in the garden, but it's rainy and windy and foggy. But she just wants her ball. Luckily she has a little indoor ball that's not as big as her garden ball. 
Let me scoot it with my foot. Let me scoot it with my foot. Okay. Go play with your ball. Go play with your ball. What's the matter? Moose won't play. Hmm? Moose won't play with your ball. That's so sad. Nobody will play ball with Sasha. Nobody will play ball with Sasha. Moose is under the table being bored because he can't go outside. He says life is no fair. He doesn't want to be fun. Oh, you think maybe there's treats involved? There's no treats, darling. There's no treats. Poor bored dogs. It's no fun when it rains. Oh no, it's just no fun. Rain, rain, go away. But we need it to rain. So I have been tasked to come down here and talk about the uh, the fog and everything and see what the river is up to, or the seasonal creek, I guess. And so, yeah, I'm going to be, well, first of all, I'm wearing my rain boots because I really don't want to have my leather boots get all messed up with the the mud and the rain and everything like that. So I'm going to go and kind of follow the river down um, sorry if the camera works all bumpy but as you can see the ground is all bumpy especially over there <laughs> but I'm gonna follow the creek um, up towards that way and so it, you see now why I wore these things oh, oh my god okay so I'm already very much happy very ha not very much happy very happy that I wore these things instead of my leather my nice leather boots and so <clears throat> oh my god it's like quick mud but anyway I need to be heading up there and following the river but first I'm gonna come down here to where the river is like right in front of our house I mean, I, I mean directly across from our house, I guess. And so, back here is like our zone five. If you don't know what that is, uh, in agricultural, in the agricultural world, that means that we just kind of leave this wild. We let nature do its thing, you know. And so, yeah, the creek's just over that little hill there. And so. I've already followed the creek that way, but I've never been up here, and my mom says that it's kind of cool up here, so, so yeah, I'm going to be heading up there. Sorry if I don't talk too much, but it's kind of tiring trying to focus on where I'm stepping and everything, make sure I'm not about to fall into a ditch or anything, or slip and hit my head, so... Yeah, so here's the river, that big collection of rocks, and so, yeah, here, here we are, and so you can see it doesn't have a whole lot of water right here, but my mom tells me that if I head up this way, that it has a lot more water, and so, yeah, I'm going to be following it up here. And man, there are so many there's so many down trees up here. Whoa, okay. Oh, okay, good. The camera's not messed up. Oh. I was worried there for a second. <clears throat> Alright, let's get up. And anyway, the only downside to these boots is they don't have great traction. But anyway, so the river's going there, so I have to Find a way to cross over here. <clears throat> Alright. Head up here. And it's a nice little pool. Um yeah. Jeez, my footing's just all over the place today. <sighs> Alright, so I found the river again. And so 
Ah, that's a branch. That's more branches. And here's just a little island or something. <laughs> See, I'm going to be following it back there. I think I'm just going to follow it on the actual riverbed itself. So this seems a lot safer. <laughs> May not sound like it, but it actually is. And so, fun fact is this, this river, or seasonal creek that we have here, is actually our property line. It follows our border, or rather our border follows this. And so, we were technically not allowed to cross it. And so, you can see a limb fell down there. So I'm not going to be crossing it, I'm just going to be following it up on the middle. So technically I'm not trespassing. Oh man, that might provide a slight issue. Um, Alright, well, you can hear some ATVs from the guy next to us. So, yeah, that's, that's a big tree that's down. Get a closer look here. Look at that. The river is actually getting rather wide and rather deep here. Ugh. It's kind of nice. It's not. It's actually not too cold. Um, that would be a much easier way, but that's not our property, so technically I'm not allowed to go that way. So. I'm gonna head through here instead. Ugh. Alright, thank you, coat. This is like the thickest coat that I have. Not because it's cold, I mean, it's cold, but it's not that cold. But mainly just because stuff like that. I'm going through brush and stuff. And stuff. So. Yeah, oh, sorry, I had the camera tilted. <laughs> but yeah, you can see the back of the tree that fell there. But, let's head back here. Now, as I was saying earlier, we don't come back here much. We just kind of let nature do its thing back here. And so, it's actually a very nice spot right there. Once and I wanted to see this. But anyway, as I was saying, we uh, kind of let nature just do its thing back here. And so, this would actually be a very nice camping spot. Like, right here. But... Anyway, I'm not looking for camping spots. Um, Alright, I think we're past that down a tree, because that's right there. And so, let's head over here. The nice thing about doing this during the winter is I don't have to worry about snakes, like at all. Because since, so, since it's so wet and cold, I don't have to worry about any of them. So, that's always nice. Well, this looks like it should be the river, but I don't see it. Oh, there it is. I see it. Okay. Found it again. Let me put my hood up. This way I don't get stabbed in the back of the head by a branch. <sighs> you guys might not be able to see anything for a second here while I'm going through here. <sighs> Alright, I'm through. Huh. Man, that's a lot of rocks. Anyway, the river is back here. Ah, take that hood off. It's making me making my head hot. Ah man. If this was just a little bit warmer, I'd probably just sit down in it. <laughs> but since it's still rather cold, I'm not going to because I'd rather not get sick. Um, Alright, let's head back up here. So the thing's right over there. Man, this is so many rocks. Ugh. I think this was the river. Then that guy... 
um, blocked up and so then the river made its way over here or something. Anyway, I can get around through here. <clears throat> Alright, so here's the river again. It's blocked again. So, yeah, great. Now I gotta go around again. So, that's. Oh, yeah, that's a no go. <laughs> Not going around there. I'll just follow this dried up riverbed. Well, sort of dried up. Still got some water in it, but not nearly as much as the actual creeks, the creek itself. Ah. Alright, here we go. Duck under. Sorry if you guys can't see too much, but I'm kind of focused on my footing here. There we go. See, it's not dried up. There's plenty of water in here. That's probably a good two gallons. <laughs> oh, okay. Almost fell over. These rocks are not exactly all too friendly to the, uh, the um, whatever you want to call it. <clears throat> okay, get up here for a minute. And come back down. Okay. Oh, okay. Um. Man, this was a big river. Or seasonal creek, or whatever you want to call it. It was a big something. So. You can see there's some more water here. Um, it's getting blocked up. It's gonna get blocked up there, so I'm gonna try to climb up here. <coughs> All right, let's head back here. Not pretty sure how far away I am from the house, but it doesn't really matter. I know my way back. Well, something's been making a trail here. I'm not sure if you guys can see very well, but it's definitely like a, a deer trail or something. Yeah, right, I'm not gonna follow that, so that's not what I'm I'm here for. I'm here for the creek. I want to see where this goes. But. Yeah, that is most definitely some kind of animal trail. I hope it's a deer and not anything else, because we have had, we have, we had, oh my god, I can't speak. We have had coyotes and bobcats. So I, I do rather hope that I am not heading to a bobcat lair. Coyotes, fine. I can, I can probably deal with them, but... Bug cats. Oh man, there's a fork in the road. Or fork in the creek. I'm gonna head over here because this seems to be where the water is. Oh man. No one ever said that following a river was easy. <sighs> Alright, so there's some more water there. I don't know why it's so murky. Because it's not like green or anything, it's just like foggy. Hmm. I, I may have to go back and take the other side of the river because I can get through here but I don't know if you guys can see but there's a big fallen tree back there so yeah, I'm gonna turn around before I waste too much time trying to go that way. Oh man. This is very tiring. This thick coat doesn't exactly help for the abundance of 
everything but cold. I mean, it's sort of cold, but not really. Oh, great. Another fallen thing. Fallen tree. This looks like a giant piece of manzanita. Ah. Alright, let's just push through here. Ah. Alright. Move, branch, move. Oh my god. This place is impossible. You think nature was doing this on purpose? Just to make my life difficult. Well, I'm not crawling through, that's for sure. Um, I'm not 100% of whether or not I want to try to climb over it. So, um, let's see. Oh, look, it's seeds. These are full of seeds. Not sure what kind of tree or plant this is, but, or rather bush, but there's a, these are all full of seeds. It's like a pea pod. Oh man, should have brought like an energy bar or something. Oh man, I can see the river back there though. Ugh, it's so clear. Um, hmm. Alright, I gotta decide on what to do. Sadly, this is not um, the U versus Wild Bear Drill show. This is me trying to figure out what they have to do. <laughs> so. Uh, uh, Um, let's see. I would ask myself what would Bear Drills do, but I have a feeling that he'd trek through the woods until he found the nearest Motel 6. So, sadly that's not really an option. So, let's head through here. Uh, sorry, the, the view probably isn't great, but not much I can really do about that. push through here. Oh man. Okay, these are some thick bushes. Step on it. There we go. Oh man. Oh. God. Now, disclaimer, again, do not do this at home. I know exactly the way back. I know where I'm going. I haven't been back here this far before, but I can, I'm not sure if you guys can, but I can see the trail that I've been making. And so, yeah, don't go wandering off into the woods, especially without an adult. Which is exactly why you should not take this video to heart. <laughs> uh, this is dangerous, especially I don't know where you live, so there might be different types of wild animals or anything like that. And so, whew. yeah, oh my god, that's a big pine tree that fell down. Look at this. Oh, sweet, I found the river again. Or the creek. Oh my god. Look at that. Look how thick that is. Oh my god. Okay, well, let's head over here and then just hop over it. So I doubt this thing's gonna be moving anytime soon. God dang it, not again. Here we go again with the blockage. Oh my god, okay. Also, for you that are religious, I am sorry for 
taking the Lord's name in vain. Just, it's a bad habit that I developed and it's kind of hard to get rid of. And so, I do apologize. And so, yeah. Just for future reference, because I'm probably going to say it again without really thinking about it. Alright, quiet for a minute. The reason I did that was because if you stay quiet for a minute, you can hear any animals or anything like that that might be coming my way. And so, yeah, I don't hear anything, so I'm going to continue going. Oh, I just busted off that branch. Alright, well, it was dead anyway. Otherwise, it wouldn't have come off. Alright, sweet, I made it. Alright. Oh man. We're not in Kansas anymore, that's for sure. Sweet, there's water again. Now, this is not a survival situation. My life does not depend on me finding this water and staying with this water is just for a bit of fun that I'm afraid I might have to conclude because I don't feel like trying to scale that I'll get a little bit closer just so you guys can see what I'm talking about there's that or I can go up the giant pile of rocks which I really don't feel like doing so I'm gonna go find a nice little spot and sit down for a minute and just relax because I've been at this for about 25 minutes or so and so I'm getting rather tired and not good to push yourself when you're out alone. And so, I don't want to tire myself out to the point where I'm stuck out here, because when you tire your body, it also tires your mind. And so, if I'm not full focus, I might not be able to see the path that I made to get here. And so, yeah, it's, it's very important to pace, to pace yourself when you're out in nature because you never know when you might have to need a when you might need a sudden burst of energy to run away from something to fight something you never know and so it's it's good to to pace yourself make sure that you're being careful because See, like, right there, if I hadn't, I'm not sure if you guys saw it, but <sighs> I just slipped. And if I had stepped in a different direction, I probably could have <laughs> twisted my ankle pretty bad and not been able to make it home. Because, as you guys can see, this is pretty rough terrain. And so, trying to do this with a busted ankle would not be very pleasant if even possible so yeah let's let's just remember to pace ourselves wash your hands I'm just joking no but do pace yourselves because it is dangerous to be doing this and so like I was saying earlier I probably should have brought an energy bar or something. I just didn't think it was going to be going on for this long. <sighs> okay. It's time to head this way. And so, yeah, it's good to, uh, to keep something on hand just in case. It would also be a good idea to bring some bandages, a tourniquet maybe, uh, some rope. And really all I, all I have on me that could help me is 
my jacket and uh, my knife. And duck through here. Push that up over the way. And so my knife is very handy and a useful tool to have. It's not going to feed me. Well, I suppose it could if I and then it turned it into a spear or something and went hunting. Let's listen for a minute. Alright. Now let's head back. <coughs> Bust that branch. And we have found the river again. So let's hop on down here. Ah. Alright, sweet. I know where I am now. Ah. this. Alright, I'm starting to get rather tired, so I'm going to sit down for a minute. Uh, just take a break. Recoup some of my energy. Alright. Uh, let's come over here real quick. Go around here. And there we go. And oh, I know where we are. Yeah. Remember this one that we couldn't cross before? Yeah, well, I'm afraid we're going to have to cross it, so. Uh, uh, let's just get up here. And uh, there we go. Perfect. <laughs> All right. Let's head back up here. <sighs> Can't tell if my hair is all wet from sweat or from the rain. <laughs> but either way, we're almost home. And we got a little bit left to go. Let's head over here. So I know the, I roughly know the area that I'm in right now. And so, head over here. And there we are. So wait. Alright. Now it's just going to be an easy track home. Uh, I can even see the white of the house. I can see the whites of their eyes. I forget what general said that, but... During the Revolutionary War, I believe. Oh, man. Yep. Not sure if you guys can see it, but you can see the, the house right there. Which is awesome. That means I'm one step closer, well, quite a few steps closer, to having a delicious lunch. Maybe taking a nap later. Because this really is taking a lot out of me. Ugh. Again, I'm sorry for maybe the for maybe having the camera all over the place and shaking like crazy, but not much I can really do about it because I'm currently trying to get home through lots of rocks and rain and mud and fallen trees. <laughs> But, anyway, yeah, so, I hope you learned something in this video. If not, and you just found it enjoyable, that's, that's good too. But, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.